much for coming. Uh, we do have a full house, as you can see. Hey, I'm Kim Wolf, and I am with the Energy and Utility Career Academy here at Independence High School. Our academy started in 2009 with 44 students interested in energy and utility careers. So our students have to be 50% at risk. The purpose of that is really to take kids that would not normally participate in academies and and put them in a situation or give them knowledge and a background to be successful in a school to career kind of um, situation. Our focus is the 10 major energy sources where we divide our students up and they spend three years exploring and um, getting, delving deeper into energy concepts in each of the different energy sources. The kids have a variety of different events that they put on um, for educational purposes and to learn how to do presentations. They have a round table event, they have a PowerPoint presentation, they do forums, they do debates, um, and a variety of different things. Their senior presentation is a documentary where they actually have to do a documentary of their energy source including um, some kind of interview with a business professional from that field. We bring in a variety of different business people to work with the students and to engage in presentation skills, to um, talk about their knowledge, what they've learned. It is really a way of getting the students mentored by business people that know what they're talking about, know what it takes to be successful in our community, and um, work with the students more one-on-one. -on -one. We have noticed in our academy that we have had a tremendous increase in attendance. The, the, uh, their grade point average is much higher when we look at, at separating those students from the regular population. Uh, and I think part of that is because we take them on so many opportunities out into the business that so we take them on field trips and then we bring their businesses into the school. And because they um, are so involved with the business community that they understand that what we're trying to teach them is how to be successful out there in the real world in a real job. It's really exposing the students so much to language and vocabulary that's really pertinent to um, industry at this point in time. It is very rewarding and thrilling to me to be able to work with the students, but not just the students, to really meld the industry, the business people with the students um, so that they see that our future is in their hands, but yet it's, it's not so scary that they'll be able to handle that situation. And at the same time, um, show the students what it actually takes to be successful. I couldn't ask to be someplace different. Yeah, um, this event at Independence High School, uh, we've learned a lot. There's, there's these things like, according to like, what people are interested in and um, knowing what they want and selling our product to them. It's just like, it's really helpful for like us in the future if you want to like continue in this field. And yeah, working with the experts, you know, they teach you a lot. Like working with them is a good, um, it's a good experience just working with them. Uh, so the Academy allows us to study new sources of energy, like uh, for example, petroleum. And before, prior to entering the Academy, we are not that knowledgeable of these energy sources, but as we uh, progress, we study the energy uh, sources in depth, and uh, every once a month we schedule with business people or mentors, and we practice interviews, um, resumes, uh, how to present ourselves to business people, and that's one of the events we did today is Roundtable, where we met up with business people, we sold a source, and afterward we provided our, our um, presentation, and afterwards they helped us with tips, things we did right, and things we could work on, for example, language or posture or just communication skills. Yeah, I'm definitely thankful because before the program I wasn't that familiar with energy uh, sources or fields, and it just it's provided a lot of insight into potential career paths, such as engineering or not even just engineering, um, but also the, all the other uh, jobs that are required in um, industries or uh, just facilities um, and it's something that it's something that's really I think it's going to benefit to all of our students.